one's the barber's bride barber's bride it's just like the cullen rocking but i actually think that one's a little sharper and the star of the party murphy and mcneil baby this was made for south florida wet shaver wet, wet shavers group um and this is called south beach it also says orlando on it i don't know why i'm actually a member of that group and uh I don't remember this coming up, but I don't pay attention much. I'm a member of like 2,000 groups. <laughs> An administrator, I don't even know how many. But as the star of the party, it's a great set. Love Murphy and McNeil. <laughs> Absolutely love, love, love Murphy and McNeil. Great suds, baby. This is just a tropical, just a beautiful tropical scent. Absolutely awesome. It's a darker soap. Like a milk chocolate type of... We need a little wow on. Just to get some suds on the brush. Hope everyone is well. I'm all dug out. And I have about two feet of snow. Two feet of snow. And it's funny. You see other places in the country or in the world or whatever... They get two inches and they like shut down. <laughs> they sh that's it, everything shut down. <laughs> I'm out, baby. I'm already out. Rock and roll ready. I got a few things I got to go do, actually. Yep, driveway's all done. We just know how to deal with it up here. <laughs> but it's we laugh. It is. It's funny. You see other other places, they get a couple of inches and like, that's it. The whole state shuts down. <laughs> we got two feet. It's like, it's another day. <laughs> Maybe I'll put some pictures up, if I remember. Just because it's like really not that big of a deal, or whatever. But I guess they're calling it a blizzard. It was pretty bad. See, I went out there. I got a, I got a pretty good snowblower. And, uh... Two stage club cadet thing just hammers right through everything, and uh, um, I probably I went out I went out there three times. I did it once like morning, once in the after. I should actually fall once in the afternoon. Hit it again just in case I had to get out for some reason, you know, whatever. And uh, then again at night, and then this morning I just did a touch up, a clean up. <sighs> Just because I could kind of see what I was doing better. Plus the plow, hitting, you know, cleaning up the street. Redid the end of the driveway a little. But that's it. Back to normal. Shut down nothing. I mean, yesterday nobody was going anywhere, you know, in the friggin', in the heat of it. Uh, that's it. It's all over. Back to normal. Got things to do. I'm actually smoking a... Uh, a pork loin today. We're doing a pork loin on the Kamado Joe. All right. Wacka. Wacka, wacka. Wacka, wacka, wacka. Yeah, hope everyone is well. Doing good, healthy, happy, having awesome shaves, man. Yeah, I hope I remember. I'll throw some pictures up of the walk in the driveway. Uh, 
two feet. <laughs> I remember the worst one. I was 10 years old, the blizzard of 78. I was 10. It was my 10th birthday, which my birthday is coming up. Yep. There was a bunch of kids over for my party. Just kids from the neighborhood, you know. And uh, it started. And it, ra it rained. It snowed. It snowed for two days. Two days it snowed. <laughs> I remember my father, we, he threw us out the garage. Well, we didn't throw us, but we climbed out the garage because you couldn't open the front door. And me and my sister climbed out the garage, then ran out, dug the, 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 uh, the door, the front door, dug that so you could open it. <laughs> and then we just started, back then we shoveled. Me, my sister, and my father. I remember that. And then the kids and then like a few of the guys that we had uh, snowmobiles. And we were getting groceries for everybody in the neighborhood with the snowmobiles. I remember that. That was cool. We were on 95 going right over cars with the snowmobiles. Because <laughs> the snow was at the top of the cars. That was cool. Yeah. I remember that as a kid. So this one was nothing. But there's a couple of feet. We got like 24 inches here. But again, it's funny. I laugh. I see like places. Two inches. That's it. Shut everything down for the day. <laughs> Two inches. We got feet. It's just where we are. Like, we catch nor'easters, because that's obviously what the blizzard of 78 was. But you catch a nor'easter, it just comes right up that coast, and we always get hammered. Rhode Island gets absolutely hammered, because <laughs> we're right there. Money pass! Yep, driveway's done. Cars all moved out of the way. I got the Kamado Joe set up, ready to rock and roll for later. We got a pork loin to take care of. Are you all right? Got a beautiful edge on this razor. Absolutely beauteous. Yep. Two feet. <laughs> I gotta remember to take a picture. <laughs> At least a couple. I'll throw them up somewhere in here. I don't know. <sighs> throw a couple of... Uh, there's other parts of the country that get hammered to. Minnesota. Michigan. Are you all right? There's nothing like a straight razor shave. There really isn't. There really isn't. It's just DE or anything else just can't compare in my opinion. 
for, for closeness. That's just ridiculous. Comfortable. Plus, I did I shave yesterday? I don't remember if I shaved yesterday or not. I don't even remember. <laughs> but anyway, I went wacka. This is the Barber's Bride. I consider that a little Spanish point. I think they call it square, but it's not. That's a Spanish point, in my opinion. It's got a little bit of a beautiful razor. Absolutely gorgeous. We went 38, 24, Savile Row. <laughs> Let's throw that over there, kids. Let's get... Oh, are you all right? Are you kidding? I must have not shaved because that felt so good. I don't think I did. I don't remember. <laughs> Let's get another. Oh, you skip a day. It just feels so much better. It really does. Let's get that off. Let's go Lancaster. And I love Murphy and McNeil. Great performer. Absolutely great performer. You got a few that are up top. Shock, Barrister and Man, 345, and Murphy and McNeil. Uh, I've been using Gary Man. I need to use Gary Man. Um, well, there's a, there's a bunch. There's a bunch of just great soaps, seriously. But here we go. This is Murphy and McNeil. This was for the South Florida Wet Shavers Group, and it's South Beach, and it's just a tropical scent. Absolutely beautiful. And it's, I got two feet of snow out there, and this makes me feel like I'm uh, under a palm tree somewhere. <laughs> it's actually sunny today. I'll, I'll, maybe I'll do a video or something. I don't know. Oh, St. Bots. A and E, St. Bots. Same type of scent. Oh, same type of scent. Absolutely beauteous. Oh, are you kidding? Where's the, where's the virgin pina colada? <laughs> All right, there we have it. We're smelling awesome. We're feeling good. We're all dug out. All right, let me go do a quick video, quick, quick. I'll maybe I'll put it. I'll put it in the back. I'll put it after, right after this. <laughs> all right, adios. Gotta run. See you later. All right, this is right outside my door. Here's my walk. And I don't know if you can see that, but that's like two and a half, three feet right there. <laughs> it, it, it's past my knee. <laughs> but it's my driveway. And there's just feet. Feet of snow. That's all right. There's the Kamado. Kamado Joe is ready to rock and roll, baby. But look, we had feet. People are just, that's it. Back to normal. All right. I gotta run. Adios, kids.